<laughs> I don't like Wendy right now. <laughs> Oh. Me and Val are having fish and chips. I'm just having matzo sticks because I ate already. Val's gonna munch down. Okay. We are in Uxbridge right now at McDonald's. Just enjoying our food. Here's Debra. She's really hungry. She said she was almost fainting. She got the McWrap, which is, I tried it and it was really good. Can I have some? It has, bacon, really it has pork in it though. Oh. I just want to throw her off. So good. Just arrived at our destination. Take a look. It is called the Durham Regional Forest in Oxnard, California. Is it Oxnard? What's Oxnard? It's Umbridge actually. Oxbridge. It's Oxbridge. Oxbridge. So uh, we're just opening up a bottle of wine. Can you smell it? Deborah's telling me that it's sweet, but oh, I know she's lying because it's red not, wine. Red wine is never sweet unless it's uh, port. It smells bitter as hell to me. I don't know about you guys. Sweet. Let's get the first reaction here of whether it's bitter or not. Wow, it's sweet. She said it's sweet. Mm -hmm. I'll be the judge of the sweetness. <laughs> it's not bad. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's Delicious. actually it's actually not bad. Wine in my left hand and coffee in my right. Gross. I don't know if those two mix. <laughs> the only thing I don't like about red wine is it makes your teeth yellow. Which you sucks. know what? That's actually wrong too. Like it immediately stains your teeth, mm -hmm. but wine stains just as much if you're a wine white wine drinker. Oh yeah? Yeah, I read it somewhere. I heard oh, coffee really? stains your teeth. Yeah, it does. That's why my teeth is really yellow. It's okay guys, they have cures for this kind of shit already. Bodacious. Guys, it's called Bodacious. Bodacious, <laughs> bodacious babes. You're bodacious. Are you bodacious, RC? Yep. There was this officer who asked this girl what she was doing tonight. Mm -hmm. And she was like, oh, I have a boyfriend. Mm -hmm. So then after the cop, the cop's like, oh, okay, I'll write you up a ticket then. Huh. What do you guys think about that? Horrible. <laughs> Horrible. If, if you guys were in that situation, would you just play along? Um, if he was about to give me a ticket, mm -hmm. probably. Yeah? Yeah. I'll probably be like, yeah, I'm not doing anything tonight. You can come meet me somewhere and then never show up. All right, so we are at Durham Regional Trail. We are walking around. This is what Deborah wanted, the ruggediness. Debra, is this what you're looking for? Yeah. Kind of rugged. This is how I always picture hiking was when I was a kid. <laughs> Guys, isn't it crazy how bright the sun is? Like, there's all these forests and trees here, mm -hmm. but yet the sun is bright enough that, like, it's like bright still yeah. in the middle of the forest. Yeah. So this is how not to tie a hammer. So this is what not to do, okay, yeah, guys? What not to do? Not a proper way to lie in a hammock. There's a proper way to lie in a hammock. Yeah, a more comfortable one. There's no such thing. You just lie down. You you cross your legs. We're so prepared. We even have a knife. Yeah. That means bears can't mess with us. Yeah. Holy shit! What? Holy shit! What? <laughs> I don't like Wendy right now. <laughs> <I'm so scared. laughs> and that's how you scare Deborah. <laughs> Wendy actually knows how to scare me. I hate it. <laughs> All the way around. Do you loop it twice? No. One more. This is enough. Look. Like that. Okay. Are you sure? Oh yeah. Okay. And Kay. the right way. Yeah. Okay. How would you normally lie in a hammock? Here, let me show you guys how to properly lie in a hammock. 
So obviously, first you sit down in it. That's step number one. Step number two. Ow. Ow. <laughs> <laughs> step number two is you put your weight on the bottom and then you stretch out your legs and that is it. But your back is curved and you're not comfortable. This feels pretty comfy. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> <laughs> okay, show us, Debra. Okay. Show us, show us the way. This is according to YouTube. Let's first game. put two legs here. So at least okay. you know you're not fumbling around. And then when you sit down, you could be there already. And then the right way is diagonal. <laughs> it's not large enough. It's supposed to be diagonal. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I see. It's not just large enough. I wish it was bigger. If it was bigger. You look very uncomfortable. <laughs> okay, now what? Oh, it's supposed to be that way? Yeah. What the hell sleeps in a hair like that way? Can I try? Yeah, I don't know. Hold on. See, there you go. Look how straight I am right now. Do you see it? Uh, like, my hammock's just not big enough. Yeah. If it was big enough and I was a bit diagonal, it would be perfect. Mm, okay. This is actually comfortable now. I like it. I thought it was comfy when I did it. It's pretty damn comfy. Let me take a photo right of Wendy. Now. Can I have my wine now, course. please? <laughs> Can I have my wine now? But try lying down diagonally. And then you stretch this part out. I can get this back part. There we go. All right, and then lie diagonally, RC. And then you try to go diagonal, <laughs> which is quite a challenge. <laughs> <laughs> so as you guys can see very clearly, my body is straight now, so it makes it much more comfortable. <laughs> This looks very awkward, RC. There we go, guys. <laughs> there you have it. How to lie down in a hammock properly. <laughs> but isn't that way more comfortable? It's alright. The other way is pretty comfy too. Yeah, this one's comfortable. <laughs> this one's not bad. The, the thing I like about this way is you can use the hammock to surround yourself. And, and that way it feels like the mosquitoes are going to get in. <laughs> Hello. Hi. <laughs> so you have a hammock blanket? Yeah. As well? Okay. <laughs> so that's how that's how to lie down in a hammock. Yes. See, if you don't want the bugs getting in, you have to surround yourself. See, that you feel safe from bugs. <laughs> As you can see, we're in the boonies right now. RC and Deborah over there. We can't find our way, so we just set camp. We don't know where to go. I don't know what to do anymore. There's only one hammock left and we have one bottle of wine to feed us for the night. And we don't know where to go. We're I'm gonna lost. set up my blanket here. Deborah's setting up her blanket for the well, night. For reason, I don't know why, but We're I gonna be food. Right, We're so. gonna be food for the animals. These are the cats. Here's Blackie and there's the other cat. How's it going, kitties? <laughs> I can totally keep secrets. <laughs> it's because secrets don't make friends. Secrets keep friends. Secrets don't make friends, guys. That's how come you don't keep secrets. They're kissing. Incest. They're not incest. They're not brothers and sisters. Oh, then I thought they oh, were. Oh, look, they're kissing now. French kissing. They learn from humans. They're cleaning each other up. <laughs> it's like you lick me a little bit and I'll lick you a little bit. Okay, now lick the other one. Oh, they almost kissed there. <laughs> Aw, that's so cute. Oh, look, they're even cleaning each other's ears. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, he's like sucking out the earwax. Are they gonna have sex now? <laughs> what the hell are you doing? Ah. <laughs> Cute! Oh, I like this. Oh, 
Yeah, I like it. Let me see it again. Let me see it again. Your courtesy of U of T. <laughs> Sponsored by U of T. Can you show me something on Instagram that you think is really good? Mm, like just right now? Yeah. I want to see like what you think is cool. You think that's really cool? Yeah. I like the angle. Go back. Oh, where did it go? I like the angle. Yeah. Yeah, the perspective in the subject is quite nice as well. But mostly because I like the perspective of it. Yeah, I like the color of it too. This guy we make teriyaki at lunchtime, literally the lamps are on the block. Yes, RC. I'm recording what you're saying about teriyaki. So this is authentic Japanese teriyaki. Yes, it is. As in like they import it from Japan. No, no the, the style in which it's made, <laughs> RC. The person is important. Smart ass. Yeah, but like, how about the meat? Is it the same as Japanese meat? Well, it's, it's, well I'll tell you one thing, it's well marinated. Deborah, are you still on Instagram or are you doing something else now? Still on Instagram. I don't think I go on Instagram that much. Did you, do, you, do you go on Instagram a lot? What do you do? What do I do? Do you do Facebook? I do Facebook. Facebook. So is like only Facebook that you like? Or is there anything else that you use? Besides Facebook. Primewire.ch. What the hell is that? Are you scared of spiders, Junior? Yeah, I don't like them. I want to record that one. I wonder if I can actually get close enough to it. Just take it for what I do. Zoom in, RC. I want, I want to see its name tag. <laughs> so this is Wendy trying a double-double for the first time in a no, couple years. Yeah. In like five years. Five years of trying a double-double. <laughs> So this is the door. It's always open. What's the point of that? I don't know how they don't know about that problem though. Nobody just says anything because it's so convenient. Again, convenience. <laughs> convenience rules all. <laughs> We're at Jackie and Val's right now, chilling, watching a movie about drugs, eating Domino's pizza. Dominoes. Uh, this is when they start. What? He wants to smuggle. Uh, <laughs> <laughs>